it's Melissa from Kiwi Banana and today I'm going to be at work for about mm, at least 11 hours. So I just thought of a video idea and this one is going to be how you can eat in, eat, you know, eat sufficient calories, at least 3,000 calories of healthy food for under, I'm going to guesstimate at this stage, under $8, maybe less. So what I'll do is I'll just show you what I'm going to eat, you know, breakfast, lunch, dinner, and then I'll break it down at the end of the video, all the calculations of everything that I've bought. May not be able to show you breakfast if we're having a meeting, but um, I can still video, you know, the empty jars or whatever. So yeah, stay tuned for the rest of this vlog. Alright, so this will be breakfast, and I've got another jar about, I don't know, about this sort of size that's full of um, this as well. So this is just plums and bananas. Um, so I made like a massive smoothie of about 14 bananas and six plums. Blend it all up and I put it in jars. So some of it I'll have for lunch and some of it I'll have for breakfast. Um, bananas, you can get really cheap. Um, I buy them in bulk. I'll break that all down for you at the end. And the plums I actually managed to get for free because I've got a friend who has a tree of um, heritage fruit, a whole range of them, and he doesn't really pick them. So, on a morning tea, and I'm gonna have some more of my breakfast because we didn't really have enough time for me to eat my breakfast this morning. That's just how things go sometimes. So, I'll show you what I'm gonna have. So, yeah, it doesn't always look pretty, it tastes blooming delicious though. So, that's I got through most of it for breakfast. Um, I just got a little bit of that and then I'm going to have some more of the banana and plum smoothie. I like my smoothies chunky. I would recommend pulsing them instead of just flat out blending them. It actually makes the taste a lot better and I think it's a lot better for the nutrients as well. And I thought I'd better quickly pop in. I am in a newspaper with a, it's an interview I did with a reporter. I will do a video about this. Uh, if I have already done a video then I will let you know in the link in the description down below if not I will be making one in the future anyway and yeah it's actually in a farming section of a newspaper not too far away from here uh, maybe about an hour's drive um, when I lived there for a, a couple of years when I was a teenager so yeah it's, um, I think it's good to have a bit of perspective different perspective um, this is mostly about animal welfare in a farming section of a a largely predominantly farming community um, and they've even got something like that on the front so yeah it's pretty interesting. It's lunch time and I've got another one of these so it's banana and plum smoothie I'll drink that and then I'll see if we're gonna have anything else for lunch and I'll get back to you. I'm still hungry so I'm gonna have some oats that I've soaked uh, with some dates to have after my banana smoothie so I've just finished that um, and I'll eat this and then next time I see you will probably be dinner time. What do we have here? We've got some vegetables, some broad beans, got rice, we've got lentils, we've got a bit of chili, sweet chili sauce and then in here is actually some homemade hummus. This is no oil homemade hummus um, yeah I like to reuse my jars as you can tell so I'm going to put some of that on there and this will probably be my dinner